So what you are about to see in these next video clips are footage that I recently took while visiting Hearst Castle here on the Central Coast. It's just north of Cambria, California, and it's absolutely beautiful. And it's such a, a legendary location that uh, my mom and I decided to go and visit it the other day. And I got some really great video footage of it, so I hope you enjoy it. And I think to preface the actual footage, it helps to know a little bit about William Randolph Hearst as a person. And he was quite a fascinating man. He reminded me uh, as like a real life muse for um, people such as Hugh Hefner and the way they lived their lives and the parties that they threw and what they decided to build their empire like and the people they surrounded themselves with and the energy is very similar and reminds me a lot of Hugh Hefner and the Playboy Mansion and it definitely had a very strong energy um, that reminded me of Jay Gatsby from F. Scott Fitzgerald's book The Great Gatsby so there's a lot of reminiscent qualities there too and it's just a very beautiful place and we were able to go on a beautiful day and when you are seeing footage of the various rooms and how beautifully eclectic a lot of his castle was um, it's very helpful to know that when he was a young boy his mother had taken him on an extensive journey through the world mainly Europe and that kind of carried him through into, you know, through his whole life, to be honest, because he didn't even start having the vision and building Hearst Castle until he was in his 50s, I believe, um, when he was closer to retirement. But he still, he had the vision and he was determined to have it carried out and he went through numerous architects until he finally found one who agreed with him to you know, by whatever means necessary, turn this very raw and desolate piece of land into something just truly spectacular, quite literally a castle. And ever since, it's been used for various movies and video shoots and photo shoots. It's just a beautiful place. So hopefully you'll be able to see why. And also, like I was mentioning, in the house, um, it is very eclectic. Um, William Randolph Hearst even had art from all around the world, furniture from all around the world, from very monumental places, have all converged into his vision and his castle, which exists in California. 